We have just received a Balak SBC, and he actually looks incredible. I wasn't going to do a review on him, but man, he looks good. Quickly, this review is targeted at average players. Okay, if you're an insane player, 16, 18, 19 wins, you're going to watch someone else's video, all right? This is for the 6 to 14 win gamers. Quickly, Balak is coming in at 486K, and you might think, wow. That's pretty bad, isn't that? It's quite high price. Look at the stats. Hullet, gang. Look at the likes to dislikes. 10 likes for every one dislike. That's a very, very good return. 500K, though, that's a lot of coins. Speaking of coins, if you need some of them, check out FUD Coin Shop. There's a link down below. Use code SUS when you sign up and at checkout. 5% off each. The safest and by far the best place to do it. Trust me. But now that I'm done plugging everything, let's take a look at the card. High, high work rates. I love that on midfielders. I don't know about you guys. Maybe high medium as a very aggressive midfielder. But I definitely don't like medium defensive work rates if you're trying to defend. I think you can really feel them this year. He's six foot two, So again, with that Hullet gang, very similar heights as well. Four star, four star. Very nice. And like I said, the work rates are the most important part to me. I absolutely love them. Quickly, his... Oh, I gotta stop saying quickly. Why am I saying quickly so much in this video? Anyway, his Thunderstruck upgrades are based on Bayer Leverkusen. I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. I don't know anything about Bayer Leverkusen squad this year. I don't know how good they are. I know some players that are on it, but it's mostly from FIFA. I'm going to keep it a buck 56 with you here, okay? Totally based on FIFA. He can get a plus one, but only if they win three out of their next four domestic matches. I'm, I should have looked before I recorded. I'm not sure if they played already. Some of the Prem teams have already played games. So you know if they won or lost, for example, De Jong is not getting its first upgrade because he did not win. Barca sold. The extra play style, I don't know what that play style will be. Taking a look at his play styles, though. Intercept is one of the basic play styles I do actually like. One of the things I always say in my videos is that the basic play styles, I'm not a fan. Okay, I don't think they really do that much. Sure, some of them you can feel. I think technical is one of them. I think intercept is one. I think anticipate is one. But if some of them, for example, like aerial... Personally, I'm not going to feel any difference with him with a basic aerial, only with the playstyle plus, which he has a very good one. If you watched my Depay review, you know how much I love Power Shot Plus. That's a very, very good playstyle in the attack. And even better for a midfielder, in my opinion, because he's always going to be around the edge of the box, maybe pushing the box every once in a while. So with that being his playstyle plus, I personally love that. And you better believe I am going to test that out in game. And finally, his stats, 83 pace, incredible. 80 acceleration is very nice. His dribbling is obviously suspect. You're probably going to want to run an engine on him. And even with that being said, I'm not really sure an engine is going to make much of a difference for Balak because his agility and balance is so low. I don't think you're going to feel too much from 67 to 77. It's just not really going to feel that. He's going to feel like a truck in game no matter what. His shooting, 91 long shots, 92 shot power. Now, that doesn't really matter too much, in my opinion, when you're using Power Shot Plus because it's almost all manual aiming but his passing is incredible. Sure, it only says 86. That's because his curve is so low, but 91 long pass, 92 short pass, 80 defending, very well-rounded. If you're using him as a get forward center mid, that's plenty defending. I don't think you need a shadow. I do think you're probably definitely going to want to run an engine just for the dribbling to test it out. If you feel like you can't feel the difference, which I probably won't be able to, then maybe a shadow. Maybe even a hunter if you're feeling crazy. Physical stats incredible as well. He looks good, man. He looks so good, you should drop a like real quick. Now we are heading into game one. In game one, I'm going to play through Balak every time I touch the ball. Hopefully take some long shots, test out his dribbling. We don't really care that much if we win or lose. It's all about feeling how Balak is in game. So we're going to test it out. He's defending. He's on get forward playing left center mid in a 4-3-2-1, by the way. I forgot to show that. I was actually... Oh, I thought that was Blanc for a second. That was Balak. That's actually a nice tackle. Wow. I didn't even see that. Hey, that was impressive. Remember, I have an engine on him as well, so he doesn't have any... Okay, nice ball. I expect his passing to be really good, though. His stats are very nice. I also have an engine on him. Makes it even better. How does the skill move come off? Very slow. Expected. Okay. I got to stop expecting players to just magically have good dribbling when their stats are terrible. You got to expect him to be heavy. Obviously, not going to be much of a skiller. Maybe some croquettas when you're sitting still. That might be a goal. Huge save from Schmeichel. Holy. De Young. Here's Balak. Here's Balak. Decent dribbling right there. I can't even lie. We're on like some terrible ping as well, apparently, because this connection thing is not going away. Nice little over-the-top ball. Of course, that should make it 10 out of 10 times, but it's good to know it's going to right now. Can I get that to Balak? Can I get that to Balak? Get it, get it, get it. No. Stupid ping, man. That's got to be the delay. Listen, I, I hate... Actually, I love blaming the game. I'm not going to lie to you. I love blaming the game, but that is actually the game. That was not. 
That's because I'm too busy crying. Here we go. Here we go. This is a chance. Left footed. Ooh, that was off his weak foot as well. That was off his weak foot. Where's he at? Is that him in the box? I can't really tell. Let's just let's just send it. He has aerials. He has aerial as well. So maybe. I think that is. I think that is him. Red timed. Ah. That's the skill issue. And that's why if you're an average player, you're watching this video. If you're a rank one player, you probably should be off this video by now, huh? <laughs> Holy. No way. What a pass. This guy's pretty good on the attack. He's very slow. And that's very annoying to me. But I can't sit here and lie and say he's not good because he's pretty decent. Offside or no? Sauce me up. I can't lie. Sauce me up right there for real. He's over the top. Through balls are killing me. Fair play. Fair play. Is that a free kick? I think Balak has decent free kicks, yeah? He, do he does. 85 free kick accuracy. 92. Okay, okay, bet. He doesn't have much curve on the ball. So this might not be so great here, but... Hey, let's test it out, huh? Why not? He's got a lot of power on it. Good free kick. Hey! Okay. Okay, Balak, I see you. That was nice. I, he's got like, what, 70 curve? That that had some pretty good movement on it. I can't even green time it because the delay is so bad. That was great time because I was so late. Okay, we're on the move here. We're on the move here. Balak, power shot near post. Okay, finding my groove. Doing way too many skills, doing way too many passes. We're locked in now. I like that. Balak's making a nice run over there as well. Okay, he's making a good run. Ball roll away. He thinks I'm going to cut back. I am going to turn around, give it to Salah. Salah to De Jong. De Jong far post. Just like that. 3 0 what? 3 3. All started by Balak as well. The first half was a disaster. It was a disaster class from him. This half much better. And the connection still feels absolutely terrible. It feels terrible. But I guess just playing a little bit more simple is helping out a lot. Maybe I should do that in my regular games. That's just not as fun. Figo. Boppy. Balak. Shot cancel. Power shot. I mean, I mean, listen, it's an addiction, okay? It's actually, it's a commitment. It's not an addiction. I'm committed to it. Oh, no. That is a goal from Frankie Ding Dong there. We got to get one back. We got to get one back. Huh? I can't lose. I'm very impressed with Balak this half. I have definitely taken way too many shots with him than I normally would. But oh, come on, we got to get back in this. Salah with the tackle. Salah to Boppy. Boppy to Rapino. Rapino far post. I mean, no Balak action there, but I can't let this guy win. The way he's playing, or well, the way he was playing in the start, I can't let him win, you know? At least got to let him get a draw. What a tackle. Okay, I see you, Balak. I see you there. A little AI action. Can we ping this one touch? That's a beautiful ball, but she is offside. That was a beautiful pass, though. That was my fault. Waited too long. She was offside. But hey. It's a nice pass. 91, 91 long passing coming in play a lot. Here we go. Another nice pass. Terrible pass from my America goat there, though. Oh, no. What a tackle. Oh, no. That was clean. This ref's got to be blind, man. Lukaku smoking me. No. No way. No way he scores this, right? GG's. It is a draw. Great performance. Great recovery in the second half from Balak there. I'm very impressed, for real. Two goals, no assists, but he was involved in both the assists as well. And that was on like 60-some ping. That was a nice performance. This here is, of course, game two. This game, we're going for a rage quit. That's all we want. Petit Kalulu, skulls popping. Weird set of icons there. A very unlucky pulls for this guy in terms of getting an icon, not hit one of the big ones. But I'm, I'm going to use Balak, obviously. A little bit better ping here as well. I made sure we are on at least a 30 ping game, which is pretty decent for me. And uh, yeah, we're just going to go for a rage quit. That's the goal. 4 3 2 1 again. Balak is there, but I couldn't turn him fast enough. That is definitely a problem with him. Again, it's something you go into the SBC knowing is going to be a problem. Is him being very heavy on the ball. A little bit of R1 dribbling. I didn't even try out his R1 dribbling last game. Feels decent, of course. A little bit heavy. Here we go. Here we go. Balak to Boppy. Boppy Travella. It is saved. But we actually got an attempt on goal, man. We've almost went half the game with no attempt. Here we go. This is, this is actually... I feel like this is his time to get a header. This is his time. I feel it. Green time. Money. Maybe the aerial thing is a little bit more prominent than I had thought. It's just a basic aerial play style. 
felt good right there. He felt good in the last game too. Just a little bit of bad crosses was the problem. Green time helped right there as well. Wins the ball back right there. Let's see if he can set up the counterattack. Strong on the ball. Reset. Bog intercepts it. Couldn't quite get it, but we do get the ball back. He's making a run. Man, I just want to get a power shot. I know I'm not supposed to be doing this this game, okay? But I just want to shoot a power shot with Balak, man. Badly. He's actually just made an insane run. He has made an insane run. Let's see if he's going to do it. See if we can ball roll the keeper. He can. That was cold. That was cold, and I think he's gone as well. GG's. Balak, both goals. Very unexpected goals. Off a corner. Class header. And he ball rolls a keeper right there on a counterattack. I was definitely not expecting that, but hey, we take it. So with that being said, is he a must-complete SBC at around 500k? I don't know if it's a must-complete, but do I think he is a very good value? Yes. I mean, he's basically a cheaper version of Hullet. A little worse dribbling, obviously. No five-star weak foot. And a little bit less in each stat. But he's also a fifth... I mean, not a fifth. An eighth or a ninth of the price. You know, I think he does the job. He's got a great play style as well. You be the judge. He's got a bunch of upvotes on Futpin for a reason. Almost 10 likes to every one dislike. That says enough about the card, in my opinion. And I, I think he's very good. He's good in the air. He was good on the ground. His power shots are nice. I mean, he even scored a counterattack goal, which I didn't even trigger a run. I don't know why he made that run. Maybe I did by accident. Drop a like. Enjoy your days.